Run, Roach. First the army's passed, then the parks, now... Grim Reaper must be having a lot. We watch it, you clod. Huh? Gods preserve ye. Me man went to see the witch again. She's enchanting him. I tell ye, sucking the life from their bodies. Scraps me the 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 Should send him back to the witch. Might cure him of laziness. Greetings, ma'am. Good day to you, sir. Need something? Got a matter for your village witch. Know where I can find her? I didn't bother with her myself. But ask my man. He'll know. Twerked his back so bad last week he could hardly move. So I sent him to the witch. Came back sprightly as a foal. Where is he? In the yard, no doubt. Pain's gone, but sleuth's set now. Should be hunting foxberries to feed our young ones. Marion's lad. Now that man, he knows how to provide for his family. Got some water rats last. They had food for days. Leave me be, and don't listen to that nattering sow. We've not had a witch, shaman, nor cunning wench in ages. Would a few crowns refresh your memory? Oh, well, if that's how you put it. Know the small pond near the village? Path leads off from it. Follow that till you come across a lone rock. Walk around that, then to the woods. Find the old cart. You there. Thanks. It's just... Don't harm her, sir. Word of your kind's reached these parts. My kind, meaning? Well, the witch-burning kind. No need to worry. I'm not out to hurt your witch. Ooh, a weight off me heart, sir. She only arrived a short while ago, but she's frightfully wise. Even pleasant on the eyes. I feel like I'm skinny. Thanks for your help. Farewell. There's the 
Miss, the cows are wheezing, won't rise from the barn floor, pus streams from her snout. Do I look like a dairy maid to you? No, miss, but you know things. Tis our last cow, none other left in the village. Rest died of hunger, or soldiers let him off. Oh, we're as good as dead without her. I shall give you herbs. Mix them with water drawn from the spring at midnight, then make the cow drink them. But first, you must clean out your barn, thoroughly. Is that clear? Thank you, miss. A thousand thanks. Enough. I've had my fill for the day. Go home. She's in a foul mood. We'd best come back on the morrow. Watch what you say. She's quick to ire, apt to take revenge. Quite a book collection. Pentagram in chalk. Ordinary ointment, nothing special. to amass quite a book collection. Valora must be some artifact or so this is where she disappeared to. Greetings, Witcher. Mr. Spot. 
square. Hope you didn't come to talk. No, to talk. Turn around and wait. Kira met deep in the heart of Velen. Thought you hated the countryside. I can assure you I do. Now more than ever. Heard a witch lived out here. Never would have guessed it was King Foltest's former advisor. I'm so pleased the world's still able to astound you, Geralt. I actually envy you that sense of wonder. Common in children, knights errant, and morons. Mm, someone's grown irritable. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I believe I greeted you with a pleasant view. Now tell me what brings you here. I'm looking for a certain young woman. Oh really? Who? I'm looking for Siri. That Siri. And no one can know, understand? Cyrilla is here. The girl once sought by the Lodge of Sorceresses, and practically every ruler on the continent has landed here in Velen, and I know nothing of it. What is she doing here? Indications are she's hiding from someone. I heard she quarreled with a witch, but if you don't know anything, sure you haven't seen her? I'm certain I haven't. But recently, someone asked me about an ashen-haired woman. He claimed she would stand out from the peasant crowd. Who was it? <laughs> Not so fast, Geralt. No humble plea. No offering for the witch. What's your rate these days? A couple dozen eggs? Three hens, maybe? My rate rises with every word you speak. I'm not sure you can afford the information anymore. Mm, you're pricklier than I remembered. Isn't living in nature's lap supposed to be cleansing? Calming? Nature stinks. Oh, sod it. Don't give me that look. I know it's Siri we're talking about. It was an elf, this individual who asked about Cyrilla. No flea-bitten Scoia'tael slob either, but an elven mage. He say what his name was? He didn't. And he wore a mask. Very secretive all around, but I liked him. He was intelligent and composed. He say what he wanted with Siri? Only that they were to meet in Velen. He wished to know if she'd arrived before he did. You leave any message for her? No, but he asked that were I to meet her, I should lead her to him. So you know where to find him? Yes, he said he found a hideout in some elven ruins near the village of Midcox. I'll go there with you. Why? Think I'll have trouble finding this place? I've unfinished business with this elf. He promised me something, but he never delivered it. Besides, I know you think as I do, that she might be there. And I'd like to see Cyrilla too. Let's go then. Yes, let's. This is the place. Been here before? No. I was hoping the elf would return as he'd promised, or else his waif would appear. At any rate, I've no idea what to expect from this place. Well, let's find out. Ah! 